150 kilometers east of Hanoi, lies Song Dong district. Lush verdant forests cover many of the hilltops, while much of the low-lying land has been deforested for agriculture, infrastructure or other uses. Deforestation and forest degradation in developing countries are a major contributor to global greenhouse gas emissions that cause climate change. Vietnam, as one of 30 countries at extreme risk in terms of their vulnerability to climate change, is taking action to reduce its emissions. To reduce emissions from deforestation, countries must first know how much forest they actually have, how much carbon it contains, and how much of that is being lost. Only after having all this information, the countries can manage their forests in a sustainable way. These Vietnamese field workers have come to measure vegetation as part of the country's comprehensive forest inventory. They're collecting information on the canopy cover and the number, size, species and quality of the trees. They also interview the local population about their use of forest resources. Back at the office, they then enter the data into the Open Forest Collect software. The software is also being used in Tanzania and several other tropical nations. The need to input data collected on paper forms will soon be eliminated with the launch of Open Forest Collect Mobile, which will enable field workers to enter data directly into a database via a smartphone device. A separate software, Open Forest Calc, is then used to process the data. As Vietnam is the first country to use the calculation tool, it's being assisted by the Open Forest software experts, based at the United Nations Food and Agriculture Organization in Rome. The software enables them to analyze and visualize the data that's been collected and report the results. Thì chương trình này là cho phép chúng tôi tính toán và phân tích được toàn bộ cái diễn biến của tài nguyên rừng trong một cái chủ thời gian nhất định. Đồng thời chương trình cũng À, xử lý và phân tích để tính toán các cái giá trị về yếu tố môi trường khác của rừng bao gồm các cái bể chứa carbon rồi cũng như là các yếu tố về đa dạng sinh học cũng như là những yếu tố liên quan đến lâm sản ngoài gỗ vân vân cho phép chúng tôi có một bức tranh à, tổng thể về cái à, tài nguyên rừng và cây ở toàn quốc. Once tropical nations know more about their forests and can use this information to increase their forest resources and the carbon stock stored in those forests, then they stand to gain financially from the reducing emissions through deforestation and forest degradation initiative, also known as RED+. They also stand to gain directly from the reduced threat of climate change. Changes in climate change, they are, they are enormous. We can already see uh, change of, uh, of rainfall pattern. Yeah, that's very, very obvious. Yeah, it comes when it's not expected, and when it comes, it's too much than what is needed by farmers. So this really, you know, it affects the, the, the food security. The wealth of information being gathered by national forest inventories in Vietnam, Tanzania, and currently three other countries and the processing tools provided by Open Forests will help inform better policy making that supports both forest conservation and sustainable forest management. It is hoped the results will illustrate for other developing countries that sustainable forest management can be more profitable than the unsustainable alternative. Mm -hmm.